Hey folks, Keith here with 93 Lumber. How are y'all doing tonight, this evening? It's evening when I'm recording this right now. I just had a brain, brain fart. Uh, oh. Beer. Duh. Yeah, so today we have Treehouse 8th Anniversary. It is a double IPA, 8.6% by volume. Uh... This was given to me by my friend Tom. Thank you, Tom, if you ever see this. Uh, there's a little bit of uh, wordage over here. That's the ger Surgeon General. Um, let's see, eight. Uh, eight is a treehouse double IPA brooding celebration of our eighth anniversary. We generally use concise hop blends but stepped outside of the box here and introduced a cornucopia of hops to a thick and juicy wort. Wort. Wort? I think, I, think it, I think it's pronounced wort. Simcoe, Amarillo, Citra, Galaxy, Mosaic, Centennial, and Warrior. Excuse me. Work in, in beautiful harmony here to produce beer of gets a little hard to, I don't know if you can see that, but it gets a little hard to read here, so bear with me. Uh, warrior work in beautiful harmony here to produce a beer of deep complexity and intrigue. Your continued support through good times and bad continues to humble us. Thank you. Enjoy. Um... Some of you may know, I uh, recently, I have not been a big um, uh, fan of uh, IPAs, double IPAs, new, mostly like New England style IPAs. Um, so I did have a Treehouse beer yesterday that I thought I was going to hate, but I actually enjoyed. So there won't be a review of that, but yeah, whatever. Um, so yeah, can art is just, it's just, uh, I don't know if this was from a picture or, or if someone just came up with the concept, but it's basically just a brewery with people outside. Yeah, I like it. It's 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 fine. It's 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 just a picture of the brewery drawn. Let's see. Has it been like ten minutes already before I even uh, proper glassware, by the way. And I just cleaned this glass, so if it's dirty, it's not my fault. All right. All right, let's see. That is orange. Orange juice. Looks like orange juice. All these things look not exactly the same, but basically the same. Typically orange juice. Uh, one finger of head. Uh, it has a little rocky. There, there are some... Uh, most of it's small, but there are some bigger, uh, bigger pockets in there. Oh, I shouldn't put it this much in there. Let's get to uh, what this smells like. Oh, okay. Uh, there's a. It's very green. There's a green. 
there is a I want to say like a tropical theme. I don't I don't know if I can. Uh, oh. Excuse me. I don't know if I can pick out anything specifically. Maybe like a there's like a peach thing. All these all these things kind of come off the same to me. So yeah, like a peach tro like a tropical peach stone fruit thing. What's in this? Simcoe, Amarillo, Citra, Galaxy, Mosaic. Hmm. It smells good. Even though I'm not really a fan of this, it just, it smells like sweet and just something that I'm not really that into. And, uh, I guess we'll get into it. Cheers. Uh, yeah, there's definitely a bitterness. The bitterness is actually kind of big. There's the green. And yeah, there's there's the tropical fruit thing. There's the peach thing. I like peaches and peach flavored things. But yeah, there's there's a there's a I'm not sure if it's just from the like the hopping or whatever, but there is like a like a I guess I guess the best way to describe it would be a uh, like a chalkiness. There's a chalkiness. I don't know enough to tell you what that would be about. It's I would say it drinks similar or or not similar. Uh it drinks what it should for for 8.6%. It's most of the flavor comes up front and then kind of fades away, but the bitterness just kind of or at least it did at least it did for the first few sips like the bitterness just like lingered through the whole thing. I think. Uh. Excuse me. Um, I think after like a few sips, the bitterness just is just kind of is just kind of in my mouth now. So I don't really taste it, but it's there. <clears throat> yeah. I mean. All right, so I said I don't really like double IPAs. Um, this is good. I don't. I don't want to drink more than a can of this. I don't uh, like. If I never have this beer again, I'll be fine. It tastes like other IPAs, or double IPAs rather. It's good. Yeah, there's like creamy, creamy. There's like a creaminess to it too. Oh, it's good. Yeah, I like this. Um, yeah, yeah, I like this. It's uh, it's not overly sweet. Also, um. Yeah. 
This will be the second review of the channel. I still don't know how to talk about beer, really. Yeah. Yeah. This is good. And, uh, so, I drank about half the can already. Um... It's a little, it's a little heavy. It's a little heavy. It's, a, it's heavy. I don't, I, that's why I don't like IPAs. Like I could drink a 12% stout and be like, oh, well, this is heavy, but it's whatever. But I don't know. IPAs, I think it's all the sugar. I think it's all the residual sugar that's in these things. But, um, <clears throat> yeah. As I said in my uh, first video, I don't have a format yet. I'm still not sure if I'm going to have a format or if I'm just going to say whatever the fuck I want. Because that's what I can do with my channel. If you don't like it, get the pun. Sorry. I apologize. Um, but yeah. Yeah. So, ty uh, tired hands. I want to say tired hands. Treehouse, T H. It's all the same. Um. Yeah, their eighth anniversary. Oh, I didn't even. Oh, that's... It's fine because I can't even read that anyway. So, <laughs> excuse me. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's it's good. Oh. It's, it's making me burp a shitload. Um yeah, I don't think there's any really anything else. It's I'll see you next time, hopefully with not IPAs, though I do have some IPAs I need to review, so, so. see you next time.